show chapters, Microsoft has better fundamentals. But buy Apple, says Heartland Financial CIO 13 hours ago, 258 Microsoft may have replaced Apple as the most valuable U.S. company. But don't count Apple out, investor Nancy Tangler told CNBC on Friday. Clearly the fundamentals are better for Microsoft in terms of which space they're in. The cloud space. The growth they're experiencing. But I'm not willing to walk away from Apple at these levels. The chief investment officer at Heartland Financial said on closing bell. Microsoft's market cap held an implied market valuation of $851.2 billion at Friday's close exceeding Apple's market valuation of $847.4 billion. Christopher Diltz, Bloomberg, Getty Images' Tim Cook, Chief Executive Office of Apple Inc., speaks during an event at Lane Technical College Prep High School in Chicago, Illinois, U.S. On Tuesday, March 27, 2018, Apple is making announcements in a bid to win back students and teachers from Google and Microsoft. Corp. Tangler, who owns shares of both Apple and Microsoft, said, she's closer to selling Microsoft than buying Apple right now. This is an interesting time to be adding. We have to get used to the recalibration of iPhone flat sales. No transparency. What's the next big thing? She said. We're going to find its services and something we haven't thought of yet. Look at the Apple Watch. It's just kind of been a stealth outperformer. Apple shares have had a few rough weeks. Releasing disappointing earnings on November 1. The tech giant also announced it would no longer break out iPhone, iPad and Mac sales figures, which garnered a swift response from Wall Street. However, Tangler dismissed analysts' concerns. Wall Street gets embarrassed. They're like a woman scorned. When they don't get the information they want, then they begin to pile on. She said, she is betting that Apple will make the successful transition to the next big thing and will bring the street along. It just may take some time. She added, therefore, for patient investors, they are getting paid to wait, said Tangler. CNBC's Jordan Novet and Sarah Salinas contributed to this report. Disclaimer.